and welcome to Melon Company. My name is Emily and today we'll be taking on The Sims 4 Cooking Skill Challenge. For this challenge, each episode will take on a different skill level and cook a recipe at that level. For today, we're taking on skill level 2. Today's recipe is chips and salsa with a twist. But first, I need to give you your Melon Company issued assignment. Today's assignment is Say, uh, today's assignment says, you know that one thing that's been bugging you all week? Well, it's time to spend 15 minutes uh, working on it. And with that, let the challenge commence! Recipe will need one cup of diced grape tomatoes. We need two tablespoons of cilantro, two large avocados. A fourth of a red onion, one tisp of garlic, and then in here we have our dressing. Oh, and don't forget we need three corn cobs that we're gonna cook. Um, for the dressing, we're using uh, two tablespoons of olive oil, one lime, like one juice of a lemon, my bad, and three quarters of a tisp, which is a two teaspoon it's fine. of salt. All right, for starters, let's go ahead and boil this. Our water is already up to boil. We are boiling it in some salty water. We're gonna need to do that for three to four, what did it say? Four to six minutes. So let me get that open. Ugh. I got some corn. Some corn, some corn. take our little pan with our garlic and add some onion and saute it. So we're gonna get that going. Oh, that's hot. Um, doo -doo 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 -doo. I touched the lid with my bare hand. That was stupid. Still level two on my skill, right? I mean, normally they just like chop their fingers and they're like. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we give that a little mixy mixy. Woohoo! And let that cook. Set my juice off to the side. I've got my nice watermelon cutting board that I'm gonna use to cut up my tomatoes and my avocado. So let's cut our avocado. Sorry, I'm having trouble. Please Alexa doesn't me. know about that. <laughs> avocado. I don't know why gentle is a word I use, but it is.
Still not boiling. So we're still waiting on that corn to boil before we can set our timer. It is getting there. I did put frozen corn in boiling water. It will cool down. No avocado left behind movement. My hands are slimy and I don't love it, but it's fine. that I'm using it calls for them cut in half but see my husband he doesn't like grape tomatoes all that much so we're gonna cut them smaller so that maybe he'll cry less he just means it'll take longer so let's do this that corn still not up to Oh, now we got our tomatoes cut. Let's add those in. And I, ha I got our corn to a boil and I've been cooking it for the last four minutes. It's almost done. I'm going to check and see where it's at and see if it's the correct softness that we want. Time to go check it. I'm going to use this hot pan. Nice to not burn off my hand. Let's see. to it so I think we're done. The bowls put the corn in. So now we fish out our corn. And I'm probably gonna give these a second to cool down enough that I can actually you know touch them with my hands because these be hot. literally looks blue. <laughs> it's like a foggy blue. It's kind of funny. All right, so after this cool down a little bit, I'll be back to cut it for you. I couldn't help it. I want to show you guys the water. It really is kind of a blue. Can the camera see that? Yeah. All right, now I'm going to dump it. Dude, it looks yellow in the sink. That's so weird. All right. I found a way to cut it while it's hot. <laughs> Go 
ahead and drizzle in our dressing. Our saucy base. Do, 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 do. All right, and now I need a big old spoon to a mix. Got our spoon. Now let's give her a mix. Last and final step, add it to our chips. All right, so we got chips in one half the bowl. We're just gonna scoop up a spoon full, put it in there. And now for my favorite part, the tasting. different flavors. But I like it. Joining us and don't forget your assignment to go ahead and deal with that thing that's been bugging you all week long. Spend about 15 minutes on it. Whether you complete it or not, that doesn't matter. All right and don't forget to leave in the comments what your favorite type of salsa is. And if you like this video, go ahead and share it with a friend. Until next time, keep making the world a sweeter place. Bye!